Ladies and gentlemen, this might be the worst mistake you're about to make. Top Rob Rob goes. Thumbs up. Call Subscribe camera. if you're new. Follower. Over on the YouTube channel Franco TV, Frank is exploring the allegedly haunted Old South Pittsburgh Hospital in Tennessee. Oh. The hospital opened its doors in 1959 and housed sick and injured patients for nearly 40 years. Now, like pretty much any old hospital, the South Pittsburgh has a dark and tragic past. Hundreds of lives were lost inside its walls, and many witnesses claim that the ghosts of some of these patients still roam the hospital halls. Among the reported encounters, witnesses claim to have seen strange shadow figures, the spirits of wandering former doctors and nurses, the ghosts of children, and even repeated incidents of objects being thrown or moved by an unseen force. As Franco TV begins his overnight investigation, he begins to hear Yo, Franco is a ballsy man. Very odd noises. Yo, Franco is a ballsy man. I only have one mag left. I need to buy me the ammo. It's very expensive, I'm you know. Oh! This is bad. Edited for time. Original is uncut. Got you. Yeah, it's gonna jump out. And it's gonna jump out any moment. Ah, uh, la 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 la! <laughs> Yo, no 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 no! Uh oh! Did I see like something? I felt like there was somebody like sitting on the bed. Was it even a bed? I don't even know, bruh. So that thing is kind of moving just like The chilling sound of a jingling bell echoes through the dark hallways. Franco eventually finds the small bell dangling in a hospital doorway, still mysteriously moving on its own. Dismissing the strange occurrence, he continues on to the hospital's pharmacy. It should be noted here that the hospital's current caretakers take great care to try to recreate what the hospital might have looked like when it was in service. So the shelves of the pharmacy are stocked with empty medicine bottles. Now that may seem a little odd, but not nearly as odd as what happens next. E e oh, there wow. it is, boys. Is an in-house pharmacy. Yeah, I need to save ammo, man. But vision. boys, this is the bad. Other side there. This is bad. I'll make sure I'm conservative. Uh, I almost fired. I almost. No freaking way. So it fell out of nowhere. Damn. Okay, oh, Don turned around. He bought a turn. He As Frank turn. enters, several of the empty pill bottles unexplainably tip over and fall onto the floor. Now beginning to feel a bit uneasy. Frank continues his exploration, now checking out the hospital's former children's ward. So what I'm going to do Therefore, is I'm actually going to grab this. Ow! Yo, you see those eyes, bruh? Oh, man. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, no. Yeah, turn on the lights. Oh, man. Oh, my God. What? Oh, oh, oh. Run. Run, run, run. run. And it's on. Is that a horse? What? Oh, what? Yo, that horse be doing. That yeah, horse? that's a toy horse thingy. I'm not sure what you call it. Anybody knows? It's making those sounds, right? Damn. Do you like playing with the horse? What? What? I feel like Why would you like even say that? Run, bro. In this room. And it oddly got actually cold. Soon after the rocking horse incident, Franco finishes up his investigation. But later when he posts the video to YouTube, his viewers notice something that Franco didn't see. Something wow. downright chilling. Now throughout his investigation, Frank says that he feels like something is following him. Turns out he might have been right. Okay, we're gonna see something. So this happened in the past? Yo, that head's gonna turn, bro. That head's gonna turn. Why would you even show that? Like... What? That happened in the past, so I'm not gonna waste my bullet. As Franco heads into one of the hospital rooms, his night vision camera captures a bizarre pale figure that seems to follow him inside. 
Could this be one of the patients that allegedly haunts the hospital grounds? Could it simply be a mist or a trick of the light? Let me know what you think down in the comments. I mean, how would to I see know? more Franco's? I'm just a, I'm just a stud muffin, man. How would I investigations? Know, man? Check out his YouTube channel, Franco TV. <laughs> the Reaper's warning. Number four. Facebook user Neri Kellerman is outside having a smoke when she sees her laughing neighbor standing on the ledge of the building next door. Neri starts recording as she asks her neighbor just what it is that she's doing. No, man, she's just loca. No, dude, loca, you're right? crazy. You're crazy, right? No. No, see. After the incident, Neri Kellerman posts a video on her WhatsApp with the title, My Neighbor is Crazy. Damn. She got an odd, unexpected reply from one of her friends. Her friend Alan asks, Is it me or is there someone behind her? Neri is shocked to her core. Oh, she man. posts the video to her Facebook page. And when someone in the comments brightens up the video, things get truly bizarre. <laughs> Aide, no! No, man, she's that loca? Bro, I was too busy reading what uh, she was trying to say. That's loca, verdad? No one can identify what the terrifying dark figure is. It felt like that it also imitated her in a way where it was trying to say it. But some concerned viewers in the comments have speculated that it's the specter of death. Standing beside her neighbor, she's being. Bruh. Being a bit too careless while so close to the edge of the building. However, Neri Kellerman's neighbor is completely fine and did not get hurt. But just what do you think this ghastly figure is? I think it's Voldemort. Let me know down in the comments. It's a Voldemort Before from we Harry move Potter. on to the next video, if you at gmail.com, friend Josh are streaming live on Twitch. Only a handful of people are watching and not much is going on. But things are about Toxic gamers to take a turn toward the bazaar. Hello, so God, bro. Twitch I'm streamers. From Argentina, yo, what up, dude? From Argentina. Yo, what up, dude? Minecraft, bro. He is. So am I. That's my childhood. Like literally, I was like these kids as well, man. Damn, son. This brings me back. Uh oh. <laughs> You that? might wanna go and hold square on the door, huh? Or what triangle. I think the chair. Yeah, no, the chair. The chair fell. Um. Hold on. Let's check it out. Turn off the. Turn, it turn on the. Uh... Oh, he went there. Oh, 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 oh! Turn on the. He turned on the lights. Turn on. This door closed. Um, oh, it's soft. The dog isn't in here either. So. <laughs> You're joking. Yeah, he's kind of spooked. He don't even give a damn. Oh, something happened. He's joking. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, both of them. End the stream, uh, end the stream, end the stream. It was the cans. 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 Dude. Um, how do I end it? <laughs> no, keep filming. I was joking. Wesley and Josh are startled by a loud bang. And Josh says that a chair in the room has inexplicably just fallen over on its own. Just as Josh turns on the lights to investigate, the closet door seems to mysteriously close. But neither of them notice. Wesley continues his game, but then several soda cans near them violently crash to the floor. And with that, both of the guys seem a bit spooked and decide to just end the live stream right there. Now, one strange thing that I noticed about this video is that when the sliding door closes, it looks almost as if a small dark figure can be seen inside the closet. Damn. Now this figure can also be seen briefly earlier in the video and remains completely motionless throughout. Now, of course, this could be one of their friends or a family member playing a prank on them, or it could simply be fake. But if Wesley Bruh. and Josh are acting here, then it's a pretty impressive performance because mm. they both seem legitimately freaked out. Yeah, true, true. It could be one of their family member or friends doing that or... Um. Um. Or it might be the uh, Chupacabra! Hey, it might be the Chupacabra man. Hide and seek. Paranormal Explorer George Guerrero from the YouTube channel Caballero... Wait, did he cut number three? 
Paranormal is investigating so. an allegedly haunted house in know. Mexico that locals... Okay, now, I, I don't think he did, but I could be wrong. ...call, quote, Probably the House wrong. of Souls. The current owners claim that they are terrorized by the frequent paranormal activity inside their home. On a daily basis, doors in the house slam shut on their own and objects move or fall off shelves for no reason. Scariest of all, they often see the frightful apparitions of an older woman and a little girl. George oh Guerrero God. has gotten permission from the family to investigate the property and broadcast his experience live on social media. Yo, I'm high, bro. Once inside the home, George uses an odd-looking tuning fork to generate a high-pitched tone, hoping to get a reaction. He then asks the spirit to show itself. Oh, why? Why would you even do oh, oh. Yo, I thought this was... A que se manifiesten. Manifiesta y esta yourself. Esta conmigo. Amigo. Hey. ¿Dónde estás? Bomboca. Quiero verles. I want to see you, bro. Why would you? You know I'm on the last mag, right? When George doesn't get a reaction, he gives up on the instrument and walks around the property to explore. Then this happens. E e e. Then this happened. Is it terrifying? Is it chilling? I don't know. Ah. Ay, cabrón, escuchen. Konnichiwa, ni hao. tú? Was it tú? Acaban de sonar el día pasado. Escuchen. Someone just hit the tuning. Cut for time. He enters. He enters the room, but then... Pero está igual. Covers. It's the same. Oh, eh, oh, está igual eh. como yo lo dejé. It's the same as I left it. Something strikes a note on George's tuning fork back inside, but when he comes back into the room, there's nothing there. He feels as if the spirits are toying with him, perhaps poking fun at his little musical gadget. As George explores the house, he finds a child's room with toys scattered across the floor. Oy, cabrón. Yeah, there was a laugh, serio? right? Is this for real? Oh, wait, 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 wait. ¿Escucharon? Did you hear me? He said. George hears the unexplained giggle of a child coming from inside the house and goes to investigate. And now he captures something terrifying. Oh yeah, there it is, there it is. Terrifying. Okay, I got my last mag. I don't care, man. I'm but uh, I'm but oh, oh, oh. Ay. I don't know what. Hey, yo, what am I looking at? Did you see it? George Bro, like, doesn't notice, know. but the little girl seems to be staring at him from the darkness. Yo, that's... So did George capture the ghost of the child that allegedly haunts this house? I was looking at this wall. There was something. I didn't even realize. I thought there was something here and there on the wall. It was kind of bugging me. Or out. is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. Damn. Thanks for watching. For more updates and random things, follow me on. But click on this video on the screen, and I will see you.